how do you downgrade from the latest iOS 18.3 update down to iOS 18.2? So this should be a pretty simple process. And the first thing you wanna do is just start by connecting your iPhone to your computer. And you can do this using a charging cable. And by the way, this will work with both the Mac and the Windows computers. And once you've done that, just go ahead and log on to it. Now, once you've logged on to your computer, you'll get this trust notification on your phone asking if you wanna trust the computer. So just go ahead and press on trust. Then the next step will be to open your web browser. And on that web browser, type in ipsw.me. And it should take you to this website. So just go ahead and select iPhone. And if you're using an iPad, then select iPad. And then just select your iPhone model. I'm using the iPhone 12 mini, so I'll be selecting that. And then select iOS 18.2. Then just go ahead and press on download. And just press on save. And while we're waiting for that to download, we're gonna go onto our phone and just go into settings. Then press on your profile at the top and press on find my. Then just go ahead and disable find my iPhone. Now, once that has been complete, this next step will be different depending on whether you're on a Mac or a Windows computer. So first off on the Mac, you'll have to go into Finder. Then scroll down to the iPhone that you're using and press on it. Then press on trust. And while you're pressing down on the option key, press on restore iPhone. And then just select whichever file that you just downloaded and press on open. And then your iPhone will be downgrading. So on the Windows computer, the steps will be a bit different. So you'll have to go into the Microsoft Store and just get iTunes. Then once you've downloaded iTunes, open it and go through the setup screen. Then select this button on the top left corner. And while you're pressing down on the control key, press on restore iPhone. Then select whichever file that you just downloaded. And once you've opened that file, your iPhone will be downgrading back to iOS 18.2. Now that your iPhone has been downgraded, you can check that it's on iOS 18.2 by going into settings, then down to general and about, and then it should tell you your iPhone version right over here. And that's really all there is for this video. Make sure to like, subscribe, and comment down below any video suggestions that you might have.